Hello Neapel Times here, welcome to a new video. First of all I am so sorry for not having posted videos in a few weeks, but I have been quite busy, but now I'm back on track and what a video I have today. Yesterday Apple released a new firmware update for the Airport Express making it compatible with AirPlay 2. So let's dive into it. So I am very excited to bring this to you because as you know I have been wanting the Airport Express to be compatible with AirPlay 2 for the longest time. I even published a video when iOS 12 Beta 2 came out as we saw some hints that it could be released and it actually was released but before iOS 12 which is even greater. So yeah, to get this update the only thing you need to do is go to the Airport Utility app and you will see your network and you will see a red dot next to the, your Airport Express. So that indicates that you have an update available, you just check, click on check updates and you will get the, the new update which is version 7.8 and you click on install it, wait a couple minutes and it will be installed. So yeah, once you have updated you have to go to the home app and tap on the plus and tap add accessory and select don't have a code on your can scan and it will show up here. Once you tap it, you will be able to to configure it as a home accessory and yeah and start using it. I have already done it, so as you can see I can already have it here in the bedroom I chose for it. So yeah, now also if you go to the control center, you will see it here and you see that you can stream music to it and the Apple TV for example, or if you have a HomePod, you can stream music to the HomePod too, which is pretty great. But one of my favorite things is probably being able to control it via Siri. So for example, I can say things like Pon Green Day en mi cuarto. So mi cuarto, which is my bedroom, is actually what... So as you can see it worked quite well. I have posted because I don't want to get a copyright strike. But yeah, uh, as I was saying, mi cuarto is the room that it's in, in my home app because I have everything configured in Spanish to be able to use it with Siri. But yeah, it works quite well. I have also noticed that it has improved the reliability of the of the Airport Express as an AirPlay device because it didn't quite work sometimes before and now I haven't had any issue of over one day that I've been trying it. So yeah, that's pretty great actually. So yeah, this was everything I wanted to show you, so let's go and finish the video. So this has been everything today, I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did and I hope you can all test this out and yeah, let me know if you don't. Apple doesn't currently sell any more the Airport Express but you can get some of second hand or refurbished uh, for rather cheap. So it's quite nice, I recommend you to get your hands on one before they're gone because what this allows you is to turn literally any uh, stereo that's compatible with a headphone jack into an AirPlay 2 device with all the possibilities that it brings and it's just great. So yeah, this was everything I wanted to show you. If you have any question, please leave it down below and I will do my best to answer. And yeah, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram down below. And yeah, see you in the next one. Bye.